Good evening. There's already a lot of reaction pouring in about this, especially from community members. We are here in Eagle Rock outside of Kevin De Leon's house because that's where protesters are, and they're demanding that Kevin De Leon resign. But as you mentioned in an interview with Univision, he has announced that he does not plan to resign following this uproar over the leaked tape that revealed him and other high profile officials making racist and crude remarks towards several communities, including the black and indigenous communities. This all happened during a redistricting meeting to expand political power. The scandal, of course, already led to the resignation of former city council president Nuri Martinez and calls from President Joe Biden for all of those involved to step down. Gil Cedillo has also not resigned yet, but his term is up in December. And De Leon told Univision that he is, quote, so sorry, and he wants to continue working on homelessness and other problems in his district. But take a listen to what community members have to say about this. I think it's an outrage. I think it's a disrespect, a massive disrespect to black community, a massive disrespect to Los Angeles, that he thinks he's entitled to feed his political ambition rather than putting the desires and needs of the community first. It's disgusting um, and extremely disappointing, right? Um, Thousands and thousands, if not millions, of Angelinos and folks across the country have been demanding um, his resignation all the way up to the president of the United States. And to refuse to take accountability um, and do the right thing is extremely disappointing. So now you can see that the rally is still underway here in Eagle Rock. There's also been a 24 hour encampment here for the past five days. And this community members here say they're going to continue, even though Kevin De Leon has just said that he does not plan to resign in that interview with Univision. They're saying that they don't plan to stop protesting out here in Eagle Rock and other areas. So again, we will stay on top of the story, but this is all developing today. Back to you. Coco, we just heard from some of the leaders of Black Lives Matter Los Angeles in your interview there. Um, who are the people that are out there? Obviously, they're organizing people out there. Are these sort of random community members, or is it a bunch of different organizations all with sort of their own perspectives? So it's really a bit of both. So you have a lot of community members out here from various communities that are saying they want Kevin DeLeon to resign. But there are also big organizations like Black Lives Matter that have been out here as well with that 24-hour encampment. Yeah, noting 24-hour outside his home there. Coco, thank you much.